<sighs> okay, so far, no falling rocks. This place is a lot harder to navigate at night. Kenny, I can't see shit. <laughs> it's actually dark. Oh, it's the ghost lady. There's like three elements going on right now. Just like until dawn. There's like multiple elements and you have to kind of you're trying to piece things together and it's fucking difficult. Go this route. Unless this is the way we can't. No. Hey, can you point it where we're walking, please? <laughs> I know you like to look around, but it's getting stressful. There's flowers here. Oh, something's over here. What is that? I can't see it. What is it? I'm gonna put a light on it. What is it? <laughs> I can't see what it is. I really hope I'm not going backwards. I think I am going backwards. Fuck. Oh man, I can't see shit. Yeah, because we're... This is where we came from. Okay. Maybe... Okay, we could probably go right this time. Let's go right. Instead of left. Ghost Lady didn't want us going left. Do you still have that bear spray perchance? <laughs> no. Don't cut you. No. Oh, I caught one of them. Come on! I've never done this before, Pop. Let's do it fast, that's it. Don't run just yet. God damn. God damn these <laughs> fucking kids. Son, what? Oh, it. Okay, we might be okay though. Hey, stop. Stop squirming. Give me a try. You should be, huh? How am I supposed to know? I don't know. Let me look at her. Nah. Get the fuck away from me! Oh. Oh. Ow! Yeah, there's still one out there. Girl, girl, girl! Where do you think you're running? Yes. Yes. Oh. Ow! Right in his face! I don't know if that was the. Caitlin! Ryan! That was kind of an ass. <laughs> Abby! Shh, girl. I don't know if you just. Didn't feel safe. Nope. Probably isn't. 
You're alone, girl. You need to find some company. I swear, that freaking fireplace is getting me nervous. Abby? Something's gonna come from the... No, okay. Something's gonna come down from the fireplace. Ryan? Maybe just hide in the car and just kind of sleep under the luggage till day. It's not, it doesn't work, girl. Hopefully, nothing's in the car. Well, I guess she's safe. He's not dead. I mean, dead people don't usually jump out of windows and run into the forest. Abby, he was gonna hurt you. You were defending yourself. I, I don't... I don't know that for sure. I do. No. No. It was you or him. And, well, that definitely wasn't him. Man, this is so fucked. Uh... Oh, someone just knocked on the door. Where the fuck is Chris Hackett? Chris, what? Who's there? I need your help. Please. Who are you? My name is Laura Kearney. Oh, it's the girl from the beginning. Let me in. It's not safe out here. Uh, yeah, there's is it a her? crazy woman with a gun killing people. I'm not killing people. Holy shit, you... Laura Kearney? You're Laura Kearney? Yeah? You were supposed to be working, uh, helping out in the nurse's office, right? And you never showed up? Uh, you and the guy, what's his name? Max? Yes, Max. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, That's her. Mr. Hackett said that you had changed your mind last minute. I, I think that we should, I think that we should listen to her inside. Okay. Okay. I'm going to open the door slowly. Just keep your hands up, okay? Okay. What happened to your eye, girl? <laughs> Something bad happened. Here we are again. Just you and me. I don't think we found anything. Oh no, we did find one. Why don't we take another look at what you've found? Oh, we found multiple. Justice. An eye for an eye. Not exactly in some cases, but cause and effect. Actions and consequences. There's a balance to everything, and we all play a part in making sure the scales aren't tipped. The moon. How poignant. Tonight of all nights, to harness your fear and anxiety and turn them into intuition. If you can do this and plan ahead, your cunning might just save your life. Now tell me, would you like to delve deeper into one of many possible futures? Hmm. Make your choice. See what this shows. Someone gets shot. Off you go then. Oh, 
someone's, someone's gonna die. Isn't that terribly exciting? So, uh, why didn't you come? Where have you been for the past two months? We did come. One night early. That was our mistake. Can I get a flashback? June 25th. Is gonna do. So Max definitely got attacked by one of the werewolves. So we're playing as Lara during this. What have you done to Max? Shut up. It's got those hardcore uh Shut up. Handcuffs. Yeah, yeah. I ask, you answer. Name. Eat shit. When I say name, <laughs> he's trying to stay calm. You give me your name. Do I make myself clear? You've got my license. Can't you read? I am an officer of the law. I need you to do as you're told and answer the goddamned questions. Fine. What do you want to know? Oh. He wasn't expecting it. <laughs> uh, why are we going to hack his quarry last night? Max and I are camp counselors. Oh, bullshit. Counselors aren't due until today. I told you, we drove up and got there early. We figured we'd just go to camp. Why didn't you go to the motel like I told you? Because we were, like, way closer to the camp, and we're broke. Hmm. Okay, Sheriff. Hack it. Wait, hack it? Like, Chris hack it? Don't change the subject. Yep, confirmed that he is Hackett's no brother. What's going on here? Not a goddamn clue. You just stepped in some grade A double prime, go ahead and kill yourself cosmic type shit, young lady. And your only option is to buckle the fuck up and do what I say. Do you understand?
stop trying to intimidate me and tell me what the fuck is going on. Is, is Max alive? I feel like I'm going crazy. Yeah. I mean, I'm... I'm kind of all mixed up, but... More or less intact, I think. Laura? Yeah? Why am I naked? What? I mean, after we got attacked... The next thing I know, I'm waking up in a jail cell, and you're gone. And now you're back again, and, and, and I'm super naked, and there's blood, and stuff everywhere I mean what the fuck happened yeah so our host was very keen on getting me to confess but I honestly couldn't tell you what I was meant to be owning up to Jesus what he used to try to get you to talk the pincher the blade Three-hole punch? No, it, he wasn't torturing me. Who does this guy think he is? The sheriff of North Kill, apparently. North Kill? Yeah. Max. What? Did you even look at the map? Hackett's Quarry in North Kill. That's the town. Oh. And it gets better. I gotta look at his name badge and... Get dressed. What's he giving you? I'm not gonna be the guest of honor at Fashion Week, I'll tell you that much. Hey! Did I say you could talk to each other? Sorry, sir. We'll be quiet. We will? Max? Hey, what'd you do with my real girlfriend? She's not expecting a lot of the things that she's doing. Hands through the bars. Come on. Your turn. Let's go. I'm not going anywhere. We can talk right here. Come on. Hey. Hey. Let's Get go. the fuck off! Come on! Move! Good boy. Hey! Stop struggling! Max, calm down. You're only making it worse. Laura. Dude, you might want to calm down. You're not in control of this situation. So we can get control. Just okay. go with the flow. Think, Laura, think. There's gotta be something in here you can use. Hmm. Time to look around, I guess. Uh, 
What's that? Oh, I saw... Yeah, when they show me something... Oh, here we go. While the town of North Kill lay there sleeping, the hag in the woods started weeping. As the bodies decay, the wolves hunt their prey, and the sheriff continues his creeping. Hmm. Any other clues? Hmm. What was that? Spoon? Ew. Spoon? Is that a heroin spoon? Loose rock, a brick. Not a chance. Maybe use the spoon. Need some sort of lever. And that's why the spoon's there. a quick little uh, interrogation. Watch it, man. I bruise easily. Damn, I'm like a banana here. Hey, the second we get out of here, you're toast, motherfucker. Sure. Second you get out. Well, answer your questions. You just can't lock us up in here with no goddamn explanation and expect us to be all butter and cupcakes, okay? Just work with us here. You have nothing to bargain with. Come on. Come on! <laughs> hey, you can't just leave us in here! Hey! Come back! So at some point in time, she loses an eye. Fuck! How? Pinky fuck? <laughs> How'd it go in there? You sing like a canary? Nothing to sing about. I'm sure you've got... Plenty to confess. <laughs> well, that may be true, but I don't think he's too interested in how I cheated off Mikey Washington in eighth grade cab. Really, though? What happened? He, uh... He just asked a lot of questions. A lot of weirdly specific questions about us and where we were going and why and how I was feeling this morning and I don't know nothing I said made him seem any less annoyed he asked how you were feeling yeah why he didn't ask you no huh rude So 
wondering how I guess they were in that for oh, quite hey, some time. You get a look at his name badge. You mean it's not really Detective Dick Whip it? <laughs> it's Hackett. Sheriff Hackett. You think he's related to Chris Hackett? Oh my god, like the Chris Hackett? Yeah. Who's the Chris Hackett? As in camp leader Mr. Hackett of Hackett's Quarry, remember? Man. Last night feels like a lifetime ago. The fuck does that mean, though? You know? Where we set up? Maybe it's some kind of crazy camp counselor kidnapping ring. That's... I mean... What? Well, I guess Sheriff Hackett's not exactly acting like a typical kidnapper, but he's not acting like a typical cop either. Well, how do you know how kidnappers act? I'm just trying to get us out of here, and I can't get us out of here until I have some clue of why the fuck we're in here. I don't know. What if we can't make sense of it? What? Well, you we have to. Sometimes things just don't make sense. What then? We're just stuck in a backwater jail cell for the rest of our lives? This isn't forever, Max. You can't just hold us here forever. You didn't seem too convinced of that. You gotta stay positive. You can't think like that. Why not? Might as well just accept it, right? No, fuck that. Think about the rest of the summer, Max. And school? I mean, I've been dreaming about becoming a vet since I was five years old. I'm not gonna let this fleabag fuckface stop me. First, we're gonna get the hell out of this mess and enjoy the rest of summer, and then college. I mean, if we're gonna freaking crush it at orientation, we gotta get all our classes down. Laura. Did you look at all the options, by the way? I mean, it's a lot easier for me because I just need the classes that'll let me major in veterinary sciences. Laura. You're undecided, so you have to make sure you get a really good balance of Laura. everything. Laura. Stop. Why? I, I didn't get in. What? I got rejected from the waitlist. Uh. Why didn't you tell me? I, I was embarrassed. Wait, your grades were good and you wrote a great essay? Yeah, apparently not good enough. Fuck. Have you been making plans, Max? What the fuck? I don't know. What do you want me to say? I'm sorry, Max. This, this really sucks. Hey, it's not the worst thing to happen this summer. I'm sorry. I shouldn't have kept it from you. You know you can talk to me about anything, right? Yeah. Yeah, I do. Okay, let's just focus on getting out of here for now. Great, sign me up. We need to go over it from the beginning. Like from when we left home? Like from when we ran into the cop. So after we ran into that... Whatever we ran into? Yeah. Actually, yeah, that's when shit started getting weird. The dude acted super weird when we said we 